So I've seen many regular people blow up on Instagram and I've always wondered, can I do the same? Well, I decided I might as well give it a try. And you know, in all honesty, the results of this little challenge didn't really go as I was expecting. And no, it's not also what you think. Let me explain. For you to fully understand the story, we will need to go back in time to 2019. It's the time when I first heard about TikTok and for almost a year I hammered out daily videos, which ended up landing me a massive audience, a blue check mark, but also a pretty hefty burnout for short form vertical video content. So when Instagram Reels came along, I instantly recognized the fact that this is probably also a huge opportunity to grow. However, the spark just wasn't there anymore. I couldn't get myself to post the whole of the content and definitely not in the same amount of volume as I had on TikTok. And those of you who follow me on Instagram, you probably noticed that I didn't really post anything at all for a month. But as I said before, a few weeks ago, I was feeling very motivated and I wanted to see what would happen if I would post daily. And also, can I even manage daily uploads now that I have two kids? Well, I needed a simple game plan. Post a reel every day for at least 30 days straight. And between me and you, then I truthfully thought that this challenge would just instantly net me more followers. However, to my big surprise, that just wasn't the case. You see, after three weeks of posting daily, I hadn't really gained a single follower. And to make matters worse, then I was actually losing them. And in all honesty, that simply just sucks on so many different levels. Not only does it feel like you're totally wasting your time, but also because this is on social media where people are liking or disliking your stuff, it's kind of hard not to take it a tiny bit personal either, you know? However, I'm not the type of person that easily gives up. And I couldn't stop to think about the question, why was I losing followers? To help me find the answers I was looking for, I decided to do the only logical thing in this situation to lay under the blanket of knowledge. And as I was lying there, the realization just all of a sudden hit me that it might probably have to do with a two different reasons. The first one I think has to do with, because I hadn't been posting for so long, people simply had just forgotten about me. So when I started to push out all this content again, they were seeing me on the screens and they might have just been reminded, you know, who, who the hell is this guy? He sucks, you know, unfollow. And the second reason I think this was uh, like turning into a big, big failure, I think it might be the fact that vertical video content had just evolved so much since I was so active in the space that when I come back and do the same style of videos I was doing back then, it just wasn't, um wasn't working anymore, you know? Strengthened by my enlightenment, I decided to get back to work, reevaluate my plan, not quit and not give up. And after a week or so, it just happened. Whatever had clogged the river of growth was now gone. And people just started to pouring in, like massively, which was absolutely insane because my account had more or less been stagnant and dead for months. And as soon as I saw that happened, I knew from experience that now was not the time to stop. So once those 30 days, you know, were over, I wanted to keep on pushing it because if you ever catch that like viral momentum or the attention wave on social media then my biggest recommendation to you is to hammer the iron while it's hot and hammer i did and for the first time in a really long time that's a lot of time for you right there i was feeling motivated again for short form vertical video content. And in a short period, I'd managed to take my count from around 50,000 to over 150,000, which is just an absolutely crazy amount of growth. Now you might be asking yourself, can I do this too? Is there a way for me to also make my Instagram blow up? Well, the truth is yes, of course. Obviously, if I can do it, then you can do it too. The first thing that you have to realize is the fact that at the moment there is a huge opportunity in short form vertical videos. Whether you like it or not, everybody is trying to copy TikTok at the moment. So they're pushing really on this type of content and that's what you should focus on too. Also, consistency is the key. You need to post a lot of content. Like how much? I, I don't know, there is no golden rule. But I would say that like the more the better without sacrificing, you know, too much of the quality. And that is, you know, the next thing. Try to make the best content you possibly can. For instance, this type of content here, this takes me a few hours to create, and this is just like 10 to 20, 30 seconds. It's scripting, it's lighting, it's filming, it's audio, it's editing, it's everything. And I think it's performing accordingly. Many of these have hundreds and thousands of views, you know. But then again, don't procrastinate. The time is now. Just push out content, see if it works, reevaluate, make a game plan, and go for it, you know? that like the biggest thing I can tell you, just go for it. What are you waiting for, you know? Like we honestly don't know how long 
this is gonna last. There was a time when you could grow immensely on Instagram with just photography. It hasn't been that for so many years. And then please, I'm begging you, don't get discouraged if it doesn't work straight away. It can take a little time, you know. Just be consistent. That is the biggest, biggest, biggest tip that I can give you after like almost seven years of posting on social media. You know, I was posting here on YouTube for a few years and nobody was watching, but I just loved the grind. I love creating and it was just such a fun process of always trying to better myself and do this, you know, as a living. Now, if you want to see how I was able to make $4,000 a month with less than 20,000 subscribers, then by all means, click this video right here. 